Report self-employment business income in Textron Web after putting the identification information about the taxpayer. We will be in income profile. In income profile, you will go to the question number five. One, two, three, four, five. Did you receive self-employment or rental income? Check mark, yes. You will have three T slips open T5013, 12, T1204, and T4A. If you do have any of this slip, you will check mark this, otherwise, leave it blank and click next. And now you have different income informations business professional income, farming income, agri stability program, fishing income real estate rental income or any other contract income related to with Canada Employment Insurance Commission through Service Canada. In most of the cases, the option number one will be exercise business professional or commission income. We click yes and click next. Business name, business name for self-employment, mostly the taxpayer name. If there is a business number, we will write the business number here. Otherwise, leave it blank. Type of income, drop menu, we'll choose business income. And the period we are covering from 2020. Industry code and the main product or service. For example, daycare, business, we put daycare. An industry code, we can write down. We will drop menu and we can say, at the moment you will write down, it will search for you and you will click child daycare services. So that's how you will choose the option industry code for that. Is your business address same as your home address? This will come yes by default and click next. Now you will have income information. You will put the data for the income here. Say for example, $15,000 for the daycare for the year. So you will leave all those field blank which are not related to you. You does not need to go to fill in all these things. Just focus what is related to your type of business income. Click next, make the data entry for the expense of which is related to you. So all types of expenses are written there, but you will choose the field for that expense only, which is related to your business income, something like this. So click next. Now, do you have any work related motor vehicle expense? Most of the daycare does not have motor vehicle expense. So we will leave it blank because this is not related to this kind of industry, this kind of work. So click next. Do you, did you use your home office for business purposes? Yes. Now this is something related to Home daycare, here you will write down the area used for business purpose. Heat, electricity, insurance, maintenance, mortgage interest and property taxes. And any other, most of the time in any other field cover the water cost. And then click next. If there is any, any major capital asset where CCA can be claimed, we will cl click yes, otherwise leave that field blank. And click next. This last profile page for the business related to the uh, internet business or any dispositions or any other type of business for the year. Click next, now your income statement, you can Click this summary profile to create a PDF to see how your T2125 looks like. You can open it and that you can see
This is how we will complete the T2125 while using Textron Web. Thanks for tuning in. Be sure to check out our other videos on our Textron channel. And don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button to receive more videos. See you next time.